All right, here we go. Let's get a little bit more flour on your mat here. There you go. Where are the treats going to go then? On the... the Humane Society. We're donating them to the Humane Society. Okay. Oh, great uh, job. <laughs> Let's get that out there. What are, what are the kinds of things does the baking club do when you're not doing dog treats? Uh, well, we actually meet once a week, yeah. and we do things like muffins. Uh, I think we did brownies last, right, Mary? Brownies. We did cookies. Um, yeah, cake. We do, we do it all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We made the dough last week. So we did all the heavy lifting last week. This week is just fun. Yeah, we did. Just I was wondering if you all had thoughts about Dr. King's legacy and... and uh, why it's important to celebrate it every year? <laughs> well, I think that if he wasn't shot in the first place, he would have been able to continue to do a lot more uh, good for his own people. And maybe yeah. things might have been uh, uh, a lot better or, or different. Dr. Martin Luther King Jr.'s his legacy and his mission, it, it continues on to this day. Mm -hmm. um, of course, it has gotten lost in the shuffle with other, you know, political things that are going on, but mm -hmm. still, it's still a strong movement. Mm -hmm. You still have, you know, people that believe in, you know, and freedom for all, justice for all. It's about, you know, uh, celebrating just... his life, his legacy, his mission. You know, if we just keep on with that, I think we'll, you know, the world will be a better place. Yeah. You know, that's the mission to keep pushing, yeah. just like he did.